how everybody doing this Tommy Guns and um just something different. Using my YouTube channel is about um working out, weightlifting, stuff like that. But a lot of people don't know is that I'm a huge NBA sports collector. I've been collecting like ever since I was like nine years old, just collecting stuff. And I still got stuff that I had from way back in the days that I mean, I lost a lot of things, but one thing I never lost was my collection. I always kept up with that. So, um, with that being said, I'm fixing to lay out like five of my favorite cards, my favorite cards of all time. Well, not all time. I got other good ones, but like five of my like good cards that I had for a while and that I wouldn't give no amount of money up for it because it's just the time I spent actually holding these things. For dear life so it's actually um five cards that i got today i got more but i'm gonna come back with some more later on but today i'm gonna just do five cards five only so bear with me the cards might be backwards or whatever but i'm gonna just describe it to you and, and tell you why i like it so um and not they're not necessarily like uh super rare but they're good cards they're good cards to have and to get graded and to so it can be kind of on the high end, a few of them already on the high end, hundred plus, but that's for another day. So I'm gonna get it right into it. And actually, three of them are from my one of my favorite players to collect, and that's Allen Iverson. I love Allen Iverson. I got most of his rookies. I mean, I've been collecting his stuff for many years. And one of them is a Shaquille O'Neal rookie card. It's one of my. It's actually my favorite card of all time. There's no other card. I don't care if you got a refractor, a jersey, an auto. It's just the design and just the creativeness that they put into the card, the detail of the card. It's like no other card out there. I promise you will never see another card like this probably ever again. And that's Shaquille O'Neal card. I got a Kevin Durant rookie card that I'm going to show you too. So let me get right into it. I'm going to get right into my Allen Iversons first. So this is actually one of my first Iverson cards I ever pulled out of a pack of cards. It's actually an insert. I don't see too many people like posting about it or anything like that, but it's actually one of my favorite designs. It's like a die cut card. Die cut would mean it's not like actually a square card. It's just cut in a, a, a certain pattern. So it's actually an Allen Iverson Fleer. And the year of it is 2001. It's a 2001 Fleer Triple Crown jewels Allen Iverson and just the detail of it and man it's just it's an amazing card it's just if you can see just that just that card alone is just man it's just it's amazing I love the design on that and look at that the holographic and the background of it back of it Allen Iverson with his um seriousness. Turn the screen off so it won't flick back. That's that. So I'm gonna get to one of his rookies. It's actually a Bowman's best. And actually it's doing pretty good right now. It's going it's been going up in value for the last past couple months. So I guess it's I guess it's um people out looking for it or, or whatever, but it's actually a rookie. Allen Iverson Bowman's best. It's from his rookie year, 96, 97. You know, he's drafted. Um, you know what I'm saying? So, and the numbers are one. Bowman's best. So, this is actually one of my favorite cards. So, raw like it is, it's probably like a bill 50 or so. Get it graded. Be on the five, $600 range. It's one of my favorite right there. Yep, yep, yep. In the back. Like, his cards always got good poses and stuff on them. Like, he always... Show his stats and stuff, but like I said, it's one of my favorite. Bowman's best. Alan Iverson. Let me get to the next one. This next one is actually one of his top rookie cards. It's not rare, but it's one of his top cards. And back in the days when it was first came out, it was probably like a $5 card or so. Now raw, not graded, it's like a $120 card. I actually had the chrome one, but it wasn't centered the way I wanted it. So I actually traded it off and, and got what I wanted, like a LeBron. I got, I got a LeBron rookie or so for that, but it, it wasn't centered right. So I wasn't impressed by it, but 
I had the original card of it, and it's in mint condition. It's not graded, but I'm planning on getting it graded one day. So it's the tops. Everybody know about that one. It's the tops. Yep, 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 yep. Yep. One of my favorite. It's simple, but it's just the the look and overall look at them. Just the give you that mean mug. Alan Iverson. That's enough of Alan Iverson. Now I'm gonna get to the Kevin Durant. It's one of the. Um, it's actually from the design of the card. Is from the actual like the 90, 90, um, 96, 97 rookie class. Alan Iverson, Kobe Bryant, Sharif Abdul Rahim, Kerry Kittles, all them guys like that. You know what I'm saying? They got this design from that SP Premier Prospect Group, and they kind of remade it with the. The um, let me see, they brought it back 2007, the year Kevin Durant came in the league. And I'm fixing to show you this one. It's just a, a photo of him just when he got drafted. And this it's probably like a five, six hundred dollar card graded raw. I'd say about a hundred, but it's one of my favorites of his. Yep, got him in there in the Seattle day. You know, he got drafted Seattle Supersonics. So that's one of my favorite Kevin Durant. I actually got more, but that's. One of my favorite. And the holy grail of all cards, to me, my favorite of all time. No card ever top it. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. That's Shaquille O'Neal. My favorite. And there's actually two, two cards to this. And I got the number one, the original. And I actually got the um back in the, it's up there somewhere, but back in the days, in order to get this card, you used to have to send in a card. I'm gonna actually get it real quick. Wow, I can't believe I actually found it. But you used to have to trade this card. It's a trade upper deck with him in the background. You used to have to trade. They say trade it. So this card actually went through the trading process and got the card. So you get this card in a pack of cards. You have to send this in the mail, and then they send you that. It's my favorite. But until next time, it's your boy Tommy Guns. I'm going to come with you some more workouts, but I'm going to bring some more of my collection out. I got some action figures. I got toys and all kind of stuff. You know what I'm saying? Um, Pop-up bobbleheads and jerseys. So until next time, have a good night.